Hello guys, welcome once again. Uh, in this video, I will show you how you can change your JTable title or your JTable column titles. Right now, what happens is this title comes from your database. So, whatever is your database column name that will come into your title so for example I have taken employee ID name surname and age in my table so it will appear as same so if you if I can show them both at the same time you can see here employee ID and employee ID even if I have done spelling mistake in writing these, this will appear same with no dif difference in spellings or in the uppercase or lowercase. So it will show whatever is your column name in the database, it will show in your JTable. So you can see age is same, name is same, surname is same and in the same way username is same. So in this video I will tell you how you can change these title and customize these title and you can write your own title instead of directly taking them from your database so let's get started so go to your NetBeans program and go to your JFrame and wherever you have written your update table code which is written to fill the values in the table go there so this is my update date table code this thing I have already shown you many times so go there and now we will make some changes in this code and you will see that the title will be changed so first of all what I need to do is right now what I'm do doing is I'm taking all the columns by writing star so star means take everything so it, it is taking every column of from my database and showing into my tables so what I will do is I will remove this and I will go to my database I will see what is my first column name it's employee ID so I will copy it from my database and I will paste it here and now what I am doing is important so I will write my column name from the database and after I will write as and two and two single quotes and now I can provide my name so I will provide employee ID and here you can see I can give space also whatever I want to do I can give in do these two single quotes now I want to show the second column so its name I will copy so its second column name is name and once again after comma I will go to my then paste it and as then also two single quotes and name 
once again we'll go to my database and copy my third column name and I will make a comma and surname as surname but in single quotes or whatever you want to do surname or my surname so right now I will only show these three columns in my table so I will only write these three three column names employee ID name and this just you have to remember that you have to write as and in single quote you have to write or you have to write your customized name which you want to show in your J table so now when I run the program let's see what happens so you can see here I have changed or what I have written my employee ID title as employee ID name and my surname which I have written in the code so I have written only three columns and which are employee ID name and my, my surname so in this way you can change your JTable title according to you and you can verify it from here from the code you have written I'll show you so this was the code we have written and this these are our values so you can see here instead of employee ID it's showing my title which I have given employee ID name which I have given and my surname which I have given so in this way you can change the title of your table I hope you have learned something new today and please rate comment and subscribe and bye for now